Welcome to the Cleveland Bradley County Public Library. I'm glad you could join us today for um, to learn more about some of our online resources that are available to you. And one of the ways that you can find out a lot of information about the library is through the library's website. And our library's website is located at clevelandlibrary.org. You can type in www.clevelandlibrary.org or just clevelandlibrary.org. It would usually get you there. And one of the things, first things you will see when you get to the library's website, you will see um, there's a top bar that will have information. If there's something special, like if we're going to close for any particular reason um, related to um, a holiday or an emergency weather type of thing, it's be located. Like you can see right now, it says library. The CBCPL will be closed on Monday, July fourth, um, for Independence Day. And then it has a little another bit of information. It asks, um, it lets you know that we're in the midst of our summer reading program. And there's a link here that you can register. And again, that's a good thing to emphasize. If you've not, not registered for our summer reading program, you can. It's not for just children. It's for all ages. And so here you will um, you'll see a library logo here, Cleveland Bradley County Public library you'll also see a menu bar here at the top and it'll uh, browse what you will see under browse you'll see things about library programs and these are some of the programs that are available we have adult programs so i don't know if you've known that but you can click here to find out about library program what type of adult programs we do uh, we do birthday parties for children it's not like you can it's not uh sometimes we get calls that, hey we want to have a birthday party can we they want to have it here. You can, this is a, a for fee thing that you can pay and our staff does the work. They, you know, I think you have options of just cake or you could do cake and pizza and activities. So this is a library run birthday party. And we also have meeting rooms uh, that are available. Um, so that's another one that is um, important to remember. Um, we also have, some people may not understand, know this, but we have attra uh, passes to attractions. Like for, it's usually for families, and I think what we have is the Creative Discovery Museum. We also have something to the Chattanooga Zoo. Um, so those are just um, some extras that our uh, people who have a library card at the Cleveland Bradley County Library have access to. Other things you will find here, we have, so that's program events. You will also find something that talks about the collections and you'll see um, a link to uh, our online database cbcpl 24 7 databases and web links um, continuing education opportunities link for their ebooks and audiobooks so that will get you quickly to the um, ebooks and audiobooks without going through the database link although it's also in here it's also in the database links um, you also may not know we have a seed library. And if you're needing information related to legal issues, we uh, the Bradley County Law Library is located here in the Cleveland Bradley County Library. There's also an area that will lead you to a lot of different links related to library services. So this talks about getting a library card. <clears throat> you can find different departments within the library, like we have a bookmobile service, bookmobile department. We have a, a the youth services library, which also includes the teen library. Um, just various different parts of the library. We have computer resources on CBCPL that might talk about different computer classes, which a lot of those are going to be kicking back up again. And again, some of the, um, other videos have been posted that you will find also on our YouTube channel. Um, you can request materials for purchase, and there's a link here. Uh, we may be transitioning to doing that purely through our online catalog, and there's a place to request material online on the catalog. Here's um, a web training link that teaches you how to use the online catalog. If you're wondering how to do it, that this link will take you right to a training video that will show you how to use our online catalog. Here's also um, a link 
for financial information from tornado victims from the tornado that happened several years ago we received a five thousand dollars grant which helped purchase a lot of e books the audio books as well as physical books and on a variety of financial topics so also here at the end we see on the far right we see general information and you can search Cleveland Daily Banner obituaries it's a database that we have put together and it's you can find out what newspaper what what date of the newspaper and some basic information about who you're looking for oil sound lab again you may not have known that we have a a lab a recording booth that people can reserve to make um, uh, make a podcast or if you're interested if you're aspiring um, recording artist or um, technician who actually does the art of recording you can get practical experience here in the oil sound lab we also do some podcasts and they're listed here um, the Flying Apron Cafe, unfortunately, they're no longer here, but um, the Fork and Spoon Cafe is about to open on July the 11th, FYI. Fork and Spoon, um, they have great um, soup sandwiches and everything. So that's, again, this is all under browse. And a lot of the times you'll find multiple, you'll find multiple ways to access a lot of this information from the rest of our website your library and what you can find here you can explore the library and that will show you sometimes i think it'll show you the different parts of the library in different areas so like you can find out about general information about the library facilities and a little bit of the history <laughs> also in your library you can find library policies you can meet the library board and you can find out who's on the library board and what position they serve within that board within the board and then you can find information about the library administrative team um, personal uh, librarians as well as other key staff individuals you can find terms of use you can find um, information regarding our volunteer program you can volunteer here at the library you also find information about making donations to the library. And that could be through the means of, there's a PayPal donation button, you can click there. You can make a donation in honor of someone. And we purchase usually a book that goes along with that and a plate that goes on front in the front of the book. Um, sometimes we have sometimes a wish list donation going. Um, we have items or equipment that we would love to purchase and this gives a person an option to purchase some um, maybe something from the, our wish list um, maybe making a donation to the foundation or the friends of the library so that is what you will find under that donate you will find information about our library foundation and again the foundation does quite a bit for the library and usually handles for the most part gifts above a thousand dollars um, and also something about the friends of the library so you'll find out who what types of items and they have done so much over the years uh, as well they're a great support to our cleveland bradley county library and help the library prov do more for our patrons of our community um, so it's a great resource and a great place to look to become involved also you will find information about you'll find some of our recent library corners which is our weekly art article that's in the newspaper you just click there it'll take you to that particular article and a lot of times we get calls in on so much about where are you located or what are your hours and you can click here and there's information related to the history branch and the main library you can find out um, again the different some of the different um you usually don't find this here i think it's because i was just clicking on the library corner you know, but it'll give you the map of the library how to get to the library and the hours of the library and the final um thing on this menu bar is our um 
our calendar. Um, so, and this is the grid here you will see. You will see, um, it, it tells you a legend, AA is for all adults or all ages. AD is ad adults. CC is computer classes, CH children, TW tweens, TZ zines. And you look over here to the right where the calendar listing is, and you'll find uh, the dates um, of the calendar, and then you'll have the different times, and you will also see a code here. This one says CH, maybe bookworms. That's 1030 on Thursday mornings. Um, you see at 5 p.m. TZ teen rpg and teens uh, that uh, tz is teens and you click here and it'll give you a description so you can get also find information about those programs a little bit so and you can also add it to your calendar so a very important part something that we get a lot of questions for if you ever get off of the main page you can just click back there on the on the on the yacht our logo and get back to the main page. What's right below the menu bar is just a, again, a main welcome to the library, Cleveland Bradley County Library, and it talks about our mission statement. Here is a link that you can easily get a library card. Um, it clicks there and then we'll take you there and you can either download, download a paper form and fill it out or you can register for a card online. Um, you'd have to come in to the library to complete that. Here is also a link that leads to our online catalog. Then it talks about um, one of the areas of our online catalog that talks about community tab. That you'll find information about different programs or resources in our community, and it's being added to a lot. So you can find out information about um, community organizations that can help people talks about our get a little information box about you know yes we are open our 70 hours per week our current hours Monday through Thursday 9 to 9 Friday Saturday 9 to 6 Sundays 1 to 5 unless we're closed so and a couple of links about that sound lab you can click there and it'll actually actually lead you to our policy as well as um, opportunity to schedule and also here's a link to our um, podcast collective here is another relatively new resource. It's called Biblioboard. Um, if you're an aspiring writer, this is a great resource. Um, or if you want to share um, right now, we're coming up to our 100th anniversary. There's a way that you can, if you have historical pictures of the library or of some of the facilities or stories to share, you can share photographs from past programs. You could share it here. Um, and but there is three different links here, create, share, and discover. And again, here, we've talked about our database before. Um, just to give you an update. I, I think we did a training video on our databases, and uh, but the view has changed. I think it's a little easier to use. Um, and I'll go back up here in a second. You can hear some quick links like to our Gale databases, specific databases that you can just click here and easily get to. And here's also at the very bottom, some quick links to get to eBooks, e-audiobooks, e-magazines, and um, so on. Also down here where it says printer on, on the, this right white box, that's a place that if you come into the library, you have your laptop you're needing to print off, you can click here and it takes you through a web page that lets you send um, your print job to one of the library printers. So let me, let me, by Ice -Tea. Let me, playing on Sonos. Sorry, on I don't know what she's going off on me. Um, but hmm. here... I don't have an answer for that. Alexa, stop. Let me click here on this database link and show you what we have done. All You, you have some alphabetic listing of all of our databases or web links and there are many different ones so you can see that and you can click on them and it'll lead, lead you to that particular resource but say for instance i'm trying to just find something on genealogy i can just click here go back down and it will lead me 
to those genealogy links. So it makes it a little easier to sort and find different subjects. History, I can click here and get to different links that deal with history. So um, I think that we've tried to make this easier, or you can search here, you might find some topics that way. So um, I, th I think that we've made some big improvements in that part area. Um, other things you will find on our web page at the very bottom, there's some other links. Help, again, some of this is some of the same quit, um, information we found in other parts of the website. Help, you can get your library, click to get a library card, request materials for picture, pick, uh, purchase or contact us, support. Um, if you're wanting to volunteer at the library, there's a quick link for the volunteer. Or you want to find out about um, Friends of the Library or the Foundation or making a donation. Um, resources, again, some quick links. Um, searching the obituary, using the Hoyle Sound Labs about the seed library, or using ebooks or audiobooks, or computer the computer resources the library has, or news. Um, the library database and web links has some news links in there, some news resources, as well as the library corner. And very bottom of the web page, you will find a link to our Facebook page, our social media. Um, you will find a link to Twitter, our Twitter accounts available. You will find a link to our Instagram accounts that you can log on. You also, this is one that's relatively new, links to our um, video training. So um, there's one that we was just posted just recently called send, about sending emails, the, the how-tos. We also have done one about the online catalog, um, how to use that, and database. So it's sort of multiple multiple use on that. And then um, we're going to be adding this video as soon as we get it finished. Um, but I think, and then we have a Pinterest link as well. So anyway, just wanted to give you a quick training on the library's website. Thank you for coming and visiting the library videos training.